Hey guys, good morning. Larjay here all by myself. I'm alone today. Rudy and Jaden are not feeling well, so they can't come to church today, boys and girls. So I'm by myself. Of course, I'm running late. I have to go pick up my friend Dominique. And I don't know how I'm gonna make it to church on time. Yee! Larry Ann and Rudy. So Jaden's cough has gotten worse, unfortunately. He's just been coughing a lot. He was coughing in his sleep. And he, um, it's been a little phlegmy. So this morning we had the brilliant idea to go get him some medicine, right? Thankfully, the pharmacist was the pharmacy was open at Stop and Shop, and the pharmacy lady told Rudy not to give him any medicine because the fact that it's a little phlegmy right now and he doesn't have a runny nose means that he's getting over whatever it is that he has. So thank God for her because who knows what giving medicine would have done? Um, because we all know I'm not a big fan of medicine, especially taking it unnecessarily. So I'm just glad that we were able to speak to someone. Well, Rudy was able to speak to someone so that we can know what to do. Um, so we're just gonna be waiting it out, I guess, and just hope and pray that he gets over it really soon because I don't like to hear him coughing. I don't like to see him not feeling well. And also, Rudy wasn't feeling very well either. And I have a little cough. We're all sick, okay? That's basically what I'm telling you. We're all sick, boys and girls. Okay? Hey, guys. I'm not feeling too well this morning, and Jaden's not feeling that well. Larian well, went to church. Yeah, she's on the priest team and stuff like that, so she managed to go. She was also not feeling well, but it's crazy. <laughs> We've never, all three of us never really been sick before, so we don't know who did it to who. <laughs> I hope it's not me. I feel like it might have been, but like I didn't feel sick. We just all woke up sick together, so family problems. But hoping you guys are having a good Sunday. Hoping you guys are getting what you should be getting in church. I'm lucky to keep you guys up to date on how we're feeling. He's knocked out right now. He, as in Jaden. I'm trying to recover myself, so time to keep myself healthy. Hey guys, um, man. Jaden has been sleeping for getting close to two hours. Um, we put a humidifier in his room just, you know, to make sure that the air is pure and humidified, <laughs> whatever. But it's good for respiration, so when you're breathing, it'll help you. If you're congested and stuff like that and it seems like it's helping him because he was coughing this morning not a lot but I would say in like the past hour I think I've only heard him cough like once and I think that's a great thing we want him to get over this cold I'm feeling a little bit better uh, I made like a home remedy thing for myself feeling better just waiting for it to go away hopefully Jaden feels better and then I can have some nice dinner later Hey, dude, you're finally up. You're awake. Are you looking at me like I'm crazy? I am not crazy. You're excited? Look at you. Tomorrow's my half birthday, Junior. What are you going to do? Fine. <laughs> hey, boss. Hey, boss. Did you or did you not enjoy the bananas? Did you? You did. Did you? You did. How good were they? Oh my gosh. Why did you ignore me? Hmm? Handshake. Good job, handshake. Good job. High five. High five. Low five. Low five. Low, fo low foot. Low foot. Oh, yeah. Good job. Yay. <laughs> hey, guys. Church is over. I'm here with Dominique. We're going to go to Starbucks and get ourselves some grub. I'm going to get her the cotton candy frappe because, I mean, she thinks that's what she wants, but she doesn't really know Starbucks stuff. And I'm going to get the Java chip, and then we're going to be on our merry way. Oh, and I'm not going to get to take so Sunday selfies today because Jaden and Rudy didn't come to church, so I'm really sad about that. Well, we can take our own. Oh, yeah, we can take our own selfies with our Starbucks cups. <laughs> Okay, so I'm done dropping Dominique off. We had a nice little heart to heart boys and girls. We were talking in the car for like almost an hour. <laughs> she really enjoyed the Starbucks that I got for her. 
and um, so I'm gonna finally go home to my boys mommy called me and told me that I need to give Jaden a walk that's probably one of the reasons why he got sick well I think so anyway so I'm gonna give him a walk because it's really nice outside and we're gonna put him in the actual stroller as opposed to this car seat in the stroller we're gonna do that well I want to do that I'll see what Rudy says but I don't see why not you know he's six months old now he's a big boy and then we're gonna go to mommy's house for dinner and that's it there's a service at church tonight but honestly I am so tired I was I was having so much trouble staying awake in church I'm really tired so I want to just do all of this stuff that I just told you I'm gonna do and then focus on trying to rest just relax and take a nap if I can because I have the rest of the week you know on Friday's military ball that's gonna be stressful for me because I stress out about everything and you know I just I just need to get my energy back up because yesterday's trip to Philadelphia that messed me up so I need to relax and I want to spend some time with my honey and my feeling better son <laughs> hello my Jaden hi how are ya are you good were you being a good boy? Hmm. Were you being good for your daddy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so guys, we're on a walk. This feels so nice. I think the last time Rudy and I did a walk together, I was like eight months pregnant, right dear? Yeah. Yeah, we haven't, we haven't done a walk with Jaden ever. Together, right? Um, we have. We have? I don't recall Baby that. Park. Used to do it all the time. Oh yeah, we did do that. Okay, but we're here walking. I feel pretty good. It's really nice out, so of course I'm sweating. I have my hat on that I made, and a scarf, a sweater, and I'm also wearing my new sneakers that I bought at Target. And I'm out of breath, as usual. Jaden's over here. He is in the shadow. Living in the shadows, but he seems to be enjoying himself, so that's good. No complaints yet. Rudy's arguing with me because Snapchat told me that it's 64 degrees outside. He was like, No, it feels like the high 50s, and I was like, No, it's 64 degrees, and so he thinks that it's really 50 something. Yeah, because it's not 60. Like my body, like I know when it's 69, I know exactly because at 70 I feel totally comfortable. I'm not comfortable right now. Oh, well, not that it's annoying, but I'm not comfortable. It Just feels banging out. I like it a lot. No, no, it, yeah, it's good old type, but it's not in the 60s. Yeah, yeah, we just decided to take a break. I still think it's in the 60s. <laughs> Listen, Snapchat knows what it's talking about, okay? Snapchat told me 64 degrees is 64 degrees. Actually, let me go on um, my app right now and let me see what it says. Okay, travel, the weather channel, moment of truth, guys. Let's see what it says. What does it say? 53. <laughs> okay, fine. I'm wrong. Okay, Rudy, is that okay? That's okay, Rudy. Are you upset with me? Because I, I, I was running it down. <laughs> Speaking of rundown, yesterday was the first time I ever had a rundown, guys. I feel like a true Jamaican now. I've had a rundown. And it's basically just like what? Sawfish and coconut, coconut milk or coconut. I don't know what it is, but it was all right. It tastes kind of weird because why would you pair saltfish, right, Rudy? Why would anyone have saltfish with coconut? That's so strange. I don't get that. Who cut? Most, most poor people come up with that, right? They only had coconut and selfish in the house, so they were like, let's just put the two things it's, together. It's, it's, it's probably just, you know, something that people want to just try. No, really. Well, I mean, I was kind of joking. But yeah, that's kind of a weird combination. But what else? It's just like spaghetti and hot dog. Spaghetti and hot dog. But spaghetti and hot dog, that's good. Now, that's definitely poor people food. But listen, poor, there's nothing wrong with poor people food because it's banging. Otherwise, I, I, I remember some guy on TV said that they were so poor, all they had were tomatoes. So he ended up frying the tomatoes. <laughs> yeah, 
Fried tomatoes must be good though, because I love tomatoes. Put some I'm salt sure on that. Put something on it though. All Rudy, all they had were tomatoes. They couldn't put anything on it. They just fried it. Not even like breadcrumbs, like. They were. They had nothing. He just had tomatoes, and and so they'd eat tomatoes every day. And I guess he wanted to try something different. So he was like, "How about we try to fry it?" Had that many tomatoes. Rudy, if we ever got to that, if we ever got that low, would you still love me? Yeah. Why would that stop me? Why would us being in those circumstances make me feel like I don't love her anymore? I mean, you know you love somebody when you get that low, right? You went no, not, through it. No, not when you get that low. When you come out of it and you yeah. still love each other, that's when you know that, yeah, that was true love. Because that's really low to have to fry tomatoes. And I pray that none of you boys and girls watching this ever have to fry tomatoes in your life for survival. But, um, yeah, it feels pretty banging out here. Jaden, say something to them. They want to hear something from you, Jaden. Yeah, you don't have to say anything? You don't have anything to say? No? Okay. Alright, so guys, we are in the home stretch of the walk. We were trying to aim for like a mile, but I, I don't think we did a mile. I think we did less than that because I forgot you have to go all the way around to do a mile. Yes. <laughs> we did a shortcut because we uh, I was hoping that Jaden would fall asleep, but nope, he's wide awake. He's wide awake. And he's playing with his hat. He's trying to take it off. So I don't know what's going to happen. Hopefully we, we go in because Rudy, is he due for a nap? Uh, yeah, because he woke up at like... He slept for two, two hours or two and a half hours. Okay. Um, I'm starting from... I can't remember. <laughs> two and a half hours, that's a long time. So maybe he might not even take a nap. No, I think he's going to eat before he takes a nap. Because well, I, I gave him bananas and um, a bottle. Okay, well, if he's not going to take a nap, then we should just go to mommy's house because I'm hungry. Still haven't eaten anything besides the Starbucks I had. If he's not sleepy, then we're gonna go to mommy's house. And if he is sleepy, then we'll go to mommy's house when he wakes up from his nap. <laughs> Look at him, you all, you can't see, but what you see was so funny. Jaden, you're so cute. So guys, Jaden took a nap for like two and a half hours. And this is what happens on Sundays. Rudy and I are usually really hungry. So of course we were like, listen, we can't wait no more for this kid to wake up. Let's wake him up. So I had the brilliant idea of taking a Polaroid of him while he's sleeping to see if that would wake him up. It didn't wake him up. I was like, oh my gosh, Rudy, he's really tired. Now I feel bad. But Rudy was like, no, we still gotta go. <laughs> so I was like, okay, let me try to take off his jacket and then he'll wake up. I took off his jacket. He did not wake, well, he woke up. But then he went right back to sleep. Clearly he's not feeling well. So I decided to put him in the car seat and when I was putting him in, in the car seat, he woke up. And now we're heading to mommy's house for dinner. It's like 6.30 and I can't wait to eat, boys and girls. Mommy said that she burnt the vegetables. Don't tell her I told you, okay? Cause she's gonna be really upset. Ah, ready? One, two, so we're at mommy's house, obviously, and I had dinner. It was banging boys and girls. It was one of the best dinners I've ever eaten in my whole life. <laughs> I was really hungry, so I mean, I don't really know if it was really good, but I'm pretty sure it was really good because mommy cooked it. <laughs> mommy heard me? Mommy's ignore me. All right, so we're getting ready to head out. I finished doing a hat. I'll show that to you later because I still got to add the palm. Right, Jaden? I still got to add the pom-pom, right? Jaden did a poop and it smelled so bad. Yeah? Jaden, are you a poopy butt? Are you a poopy? Hmm? Yeah. And he had lots of fun with mommy and Carl. But now it's time to go home because he's tired, so we're not gonna um, let him stay out too late because he's been really sleepy all day because he's still not feeling well and we got him on a spike file, so we'll go home and um, oh Rudy, remind me to do his six month photo. I gotta do a six month photo. Hey guys, it's late so I'm just gonna do this real quick because I need to go brush my teeth and go to bed. What time is it? 127? Yes. So we got home and Jaden was... I, I tried to take his photos, but it didn't quite work out because he was trying to poop. And he's also not feeling his best, so I'm just going to take his six-month photos tomorrow. 
sorry the battery died so what was i saying yeah i want to take his photos tomorrow if he's feeling better because the pictures will look better i was just doing some stuff for a client i was answering some emails i was working on writing up my crochet pattern so that those people in my group can get the pattern if they want it free for the day and um that's it military ball i i just emailed the price list and stuff like that so i'm looking forward to that on friday and that is that it is time to go to sleep i'm hoping that rudy will feel better soon because i don't like a sick rooney he makes me sad <laughs> And I hope that um, Jaden is not too cranky. What I heard was that Jaden did a really good job today. Even though he was sick, he just wasn't acting too bad. So hopefully I have the same report tomorrow, right? So I want to thank you guys for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you are hoping that Jaden gets well soon. Does that even make sense? <laughs> Subscribe to us if you still haven't. And we'll talk to you next time. Bye!